Hey you guys, I got a special video for you guys, but first, let's get into the shout outs. I'd like to give a shout out to Love Chunks, Michelle Rizzi, and Rachel Snell Glam. Thank you guys again for all your comments. It means the world to me. Thank you guys so much. But now, yeah, we're gonna start the video. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello, my name is Sierra Robles. Welcome to my channel. We do all nails here. Welcome. So like I said in the beginning, we're gonna be doing a special video. I am doing a collaboration with Beauty Bee Nails. Her name's Melinda. You can go and find her at melindaconley99 on Instagram. I have her Instagram handle in the beginning of my channel and I will have a link down in the bottom my description <laughs> but we're gonna be doing a collaboration of spring nails yes bright colors I'm loving it you guys I am absolutely loving it I don't like short nails too much but I have kids so I got to be able to do majority of the stuff with my dominant hand that's why my left hand always has short nails on or they don't have nails on at all but let's just go ahead and get into it. I might talk through this with you guys today so I might see you in a minute all right, let's go. So I'm just gonna be starting off with a simple prep like I usually do. I already filed my tips down. I'm gonna be shaping them up just a little bit more after I apply a clear base of acrylic. But right now I'm showing you guys all the products I will be using. I'm not gonna show the glitters because you know, hey, they're glitters and they're on honestly, they're little sample glitters. So they're not all that special. But hey, I made them work. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get on into the application. I'm still loving this brush, you guys. It hasn't filled me. My product hasn't been getting stuck in it. It's the Model 1's brush. I got it for like $14.99 off of Amazon. I will leave a link in the description below. It is a size 8. Um, I'm, I think a size 8 is too easy for me, you guys. I might have to move up to a brush size here soon. And go to a size 10 and see how that works. But I am really loving this brush. Um, just be careful with monomer getting on the handle because monomer eats away at the plastic. That's the only downfall I had to it, but it's working amazingly. Also, if you're interested in the Mia Secret powders I got off of Amazon, I got them in a pack of four. I got a natural pink, a pink, a white, and a clear. And I also got a four ounce bottle of Mia Secret, the original monomer. So I will leave that link down in the, in the description as well if you guys are interested. So there's something new I've been doing here on my channel that I want to make permanent. So I want to go ahead and take in any subscribers requests. And for those ones that I do get for the subscribers request, I will make a live video for them. That way you guys can see full on step by step how I did it, all my mistakes, no editing, no music, just talking to me and asking questions if you guys are interested. So if you are interested, go ahead and leave me a request that you would like to see of a nail design and I will put event dates up on my YouTube channel for when I will be able to do a live stream. And I like doing that live streams around anywhere between 7 o'clock to 11.30 to 12 p.m. I mean 12 a.m. <laughs> I like to do them late that way I can get my kids to sleep and I actually have the time to do it. Because my first time I tried, uh, let's just say I had to go back and forth to the camera, go back to my kids, go back and forth, and it was just a big hassle. So just let me know down in the, in the comments below, and I will try my hardest to make a whole bunch of live videos for you guys. So for my thin application of clear acrylic, I'm going to be just putting it mostly towards my nail bed and slightly feathering it down. That way, if I want to do a fill on these nails, I will just file it down to the thin layer without filing all the way down to my natural nail bed, otherwise I will mess up my nails. <laughs> 
You guys, don't mind my marbling. This is my first time ever trying it. And like I said before, I'm new to acrylic and it didn't turn out too bad. It's just not exactly what I wanted, but it's still very vibrant and I love it. So I will be doing only my index finger on camera and I will be doing my middle finger and my pinky off camera because it did take me forever to do this. So I hope you guys don't mind. If you guys would like to see a full hand of filing and designs without editing, editing it out, please let me know down in the comments below. So let's get into the glitter. I'm using four different types of glitter, too fine and too chunky, and they're more iridescent, well the pink one isn't, but the two yellows and the orange one is, and I absolutely love them, and I also have to fill in some gaps I left out, but I'll just use some white acrylic for that. All right, it's glitter time. So I will be adding a thin layer of acrylic first and then I will be kind of just be mixing and matching all these glitters onto this nail and my thumb. But I don't think I'll do my thumb on camera. Now I'm going to be adding in some of these horseshoe glitters. I absolutely love these. These are so stunning. I'm sorry you guys, I'm kind of going in and out of the frame. 
I'll do my thumbnail on camera that way and kind of mix up for it. <laughs> So before I even do anything else, I'm going to go ahead and encapsulate this. That way it doesn't move on me and I don't mess it up. I really wish I would have placed it like I did on my thumb. I think the way I placed it on my thumb looks so much more prettier, but it's okay. I like the way this one looks too. So I filed and buffed my nails off camera. Now it's time for bling! Yay! <laughs> So as I'm doing this collaboration, Melinda Beauty Bee Nails also did her beautiful design. I do recommend you guys go check out her channel. She does some amazing artwork, you guys. You can find her at Beauty Bee Nails. I will leave her link down in the description as well. That way it is easier to find her. And also her, if you guys didn't hear in the first part of the video, her Instagram handle is at MelindaConley99. So please go check it out. I love her artwork. She inspires me to do way more than just what the simple stuff I do already. 
Thank you so much, Melinda, for actually wanting to do a collaboration with me. It means the world to me. And it, it literally made my day to do these nails because of how bright they were. And it made my day to see your nails because I was like, girl, how am I going to be able to do anything like that? How am I going to be able to come? How? Maybe one day I'll be as good as you, girly. <laughs> So thank you again, girly, and I hope to collab again here in the future. Please don't forget to comment down below if you have a nail design you would love to see. I will be doing live videos for it like I said earlier. I will be taking on as many nail designs as you guys want to give me. That way I can put it down in my notebook and I can continue to do lives for you guys. And I probably will be doing lives and majority of the week probably like Mondays through Fridays. I don't know. I'll, most of the week I'll be doing lives and I will put a event notification up for you guys as well. So for the final touch, I'm going to be adding a little bit of this gold gel paint I got off of AliExpress for like $1.25. I ordered it like three months ago and I just barely received it a few days ago. But it's really pretty so I'm happy I finally got it. Okay, you guys, I am done. What do you guys think? I'm gonna go ahead and add some cuticle oil in and let's check out these nails. I did add some pictures and some reveal shots and at the end. But thank you, Melinda. Thank you for this collaboration, girly. I can't wait to do another one in the future. And thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys do like this video. 
Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on your notification bell. That way you do receive my live notifications and my video notifications. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.